Welcome back to the channel guys, it's your boy N31LE and today we've got something a little bit special. We're going to be installing some Pitbull TRS stands into my car trailer. So before I get started, hit that like button, subscribe to this channel so we can grow. Let's get it started. Get out the way, you got a watch, you got the time, I'm raising the clock, even if my feelings grind don't stop, got big dreams, one big rocks, I got plans, I got All right, so the hardest part about this entire install is basically just finding out where your frame of the trailer is. So mine is kind of like right here-ish. I know that because the screws are right here and right here as well. So you don't want to put like the, uh, or I guess you could, um, but I didn't want to do that. Uh, you don't want to put the screws over like the frame type of deal so i kind of just moved it a little bit forward plus that lines up with the overall like length of the bike so marked my holes here i can just put my frame into place and then i'm going to drill the holes right here with a 3 8 drill bit so let's do that so actually i just remembered why i didn't put it like this over the frame so my frame ends like right here somewhere, but there's like an overhang that goes back like somewhere right here. So I don't want to drill into the metal because probably destroy my drill bit and then it wouldn't really be too flush. So that's why I moved it a little bit forward. So let's go ahead and drill this. Then line this bad boy back up. All right. So when you're doing this by hand, it's a lot easier just to pop a screw in there so it doesn't wiggle around. Okay, go ahead and pop this in there. And you want to install these, I forgot to say it, like like this. So they say, it, they call it like flange side up on the instructions. So, yeah, so they call it flange side up on the instructions. So install it like this. Let's get the last one ready. care about all this the dust so. get that out of there now let's go to the underside of the trailer now i'll say it once and i'll say it a thousand times more pitlanemoto.com for all your motorcycle needs not only bmw honda kawasaki yamaha ktm ducati any bike that you name of zeb can get it for you so make sure you contact them at 919-337 eight six six seven they do have a 100 percent price match guarantee they have first responder and military discounts available so if you see something that you want online that's not on the website contact zeb via call or text if you see it's cheaper somewhere else still contact zeb he'll be able to give you a hundred percent price match guarantee and again first responder and military discounts are available so if you're either one of those you can get some more money off also, if you tell him your boy N31LE sent you, he might also get you some money off as well. You never know. So contact Zeb, 919-337-8667. Tell him your boy N31LE sent you, and you should get some pretty good discounts on any part that you need. All right, so now that all the screws are in, I'm not sure what 
Um, looks like this is a 5.5 millimeter. Why I put this in so early is because I don't have anybody to help me with um, like screwing it in. So I'm gonna just put this in here. That's gonna lock it. And we're just gonna go onto the underside of the trailer and screw it in. So grab you a 14 millimeter and head to the underside of the trailer. Now this is what it looks like. Obviously this is super self-explanatory. So go ahead and just screw this in. There we go, and you do that for all four. So once everything is all screwed in, go inside the trailer and check out your work. All right, so now that everything is together, I essentially, how you want to orient these is, you can do them either way. Um, but how I want to do it is I want to drive the bike in here and then have it clip in and be done with it. I don't want to have to pull it forward and then push it back. So I'm going to have the clips going this way. You can go ahead and push that down and you're going to listen for a click. That's how you know it's locked in place. Do the other side. all good to go now the stand for your bike you want to go ahead and take you want to go ahead and take the pins out so this can slide freely um, it makes more sense to put the bigger side in first and the small side so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and you can find the hole I'm gonna lock that in there. I'm gonna do the same thing for the other side. Lock this in there. So now I've got everything put together. I've got the pit bull stand hooked up to my Insta 360 mount. So now all I should have to do is put this down and roll the bike onto the, onto the stands. And that's that. Yep, so it's in there. It ain't going anywhere. So nice job, Pitbull. Y'all yeah, make some good products. And that's how you install the Pitbull TRS stands for your car trailer. Don't forget to like this video, share my channel, subscribe, hit the notifications bell so you don't miss anything. See you later. If you like today's video, hit the like button. Also, subscribe to this channel. That way, whenever I drop any new content, you'll be the first to know. If you have any comments, drop them down below. Remember, I'm here for you guys. So anything you want to see, let me know and I'll make the video for you. Thanks for tuning in.